Okay. So next, we're bringing on Jack and Emma and Ringo too. Hi. Yay! Hey. Oh my gosh! Hi. Hi guys. Sorry we're a little late. Emma and Ringo are here. Hi, Emma and Ringo. <laughs> Let me go down farther. They're a little low. <laughs> oh my goodness! Hi. What happened to Ringo? He's a he big got guy. Big. He's a big boy now. Clint's over here like, there's my boy. <laughs> That's your boy, Clint. That's my boy. Aw. <laughs> Emma's down here. She's the heavier one. <laughs> okay, so first off, before we do anything else, happy birthday. Thanks. I was so looking forward to Ween Fest on my birthday. But this is just as good. I know. <laughs> that would have been really fun on your birthday. I know. That would have been a blast. Um, oh well. Okay, so you want to kind of introduce yourself and give a little whatever? Sure. <laughs> I'm Katie, and we are formerly Jack and Emma, but our Jack passed away. And so we are now Jack and Emma and Ringo, too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> so yeah. we're from SoCal. We're from Glendora. So we've um, attended all wiener fests yay yay <laughs> plan to continue now ringo is trying to attack so if you guys don't know um i know i've talked about it a couple of times but this wiener fest event is insane to host like it um it's literally just us like it, we don't what is going on emma <laughs> Emma, what's wrong? <laughs> are we are we playing? It's play mode. <laughs> Ringo comes up and nips Emma's butt. <laughs> That's how he tries to get us. Like Penny with a nose. Yeah. He's sneaking behind me. <laughs> what you doing, Ringo? And then Emma, I'm sure she's in full effect of crazy eyes. He's like. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh um so yeah so it, i know i've mentioned this a few times but it's really just me kat and danny kind of running the show and this isn't our job or anything and we have obviously sponsored kind of things and donations but it's really just like people who work full time and host it so katie is one of the people for us that is like in such like so much help and she always you'll probably see her at the booth She'll be selling raffle tickets. She'll be doing all kinds of stuff. So um, Katie is one of our really good friends, and she's so insanely helpful at Wienerfest, and we appreciate it so much. Oh, thanks. I love being a part of it. Love that you guys have me be a part of it. It's such an honor. It's so fun. It's, fun. it's the best. It's just, I've just found so many fun friends and, yeah. you know, similar interests, and it's a blast. I love it. Yeah. Okay, so what do you think your favorite Wienerfest memory is? Um, so the first Winter Fest, I didn't know too many people. Yeah. I was a little shy. Um, I did meet, um, and I don't know her name. Um, she's the one who kind of led us to Emma. Okay. And her dog's name is Emma as well. I can't, hmm, I don't remember the count. I want to say Doxy 83 or something like that. Oh, yes. Uh, yeah. Um, I can't think of her name. I see her face. Oh, All yeah. I know are dog names. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> Forget the people. <laughs> yeah. So she led us to our Emma. So that was kind of fun uh, meeting her. And then, you know, we kind of started on um, with our Instagram account when my husband was having major surgery. Mm -hmm. And I knew I would be in the house taking care of him a lot. So I um, joined Instagram with Jack. And so mm -hmm. I guess my first fun memory is... Um, meeting everyone in person i mean yeah. uh, annie was one of annie from bella and bailey's um was one of our first kind of online friends yeah and you know i did the thing that i tell my daughter not to do don't meet online friends i know <laughs> <laughs> do as i say not as i do <laughs> right yeah so i think the second i think it was the second one she came out and we met her whole family her whole entire family came out yeah so that was fun and bringing us all together, you guys and April and and Stephanie from Andy and Tucker and mm -hmm. it just 
everyone. It was such a blast. Yeah. So that's probably my fun. best moment. My favorite moment was just meeting everyone, having it all come to fruition and everyone come together. <laughs> yeah. And I think it's so funny. And I know people have said this in like we have a lot. Of, I don't know a lot of people's actual names, but like I know all their dogs names and stuff. And the worst so, is when we're there. Yeah. And then afterwards, I'm looking through, you know, the Instagram and all the hashtags, like after SoCal Wienerbus. And mm -hmm. I'm like, oh, that was them. Shoot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've done like big name tags. <laughs> I've done that too. Um, like, I wanted to meet Dexy the Dachshund forever. Uh -huh. And um, I didn't even know he was there one year. And then all of a sudden, I saw a post and I was like, I wanted to see him. And so last year, I finally got to meet him like in person. It was pretty cute. Yeah. I know. Funny. Yeah. Um, so what have you guys been doing during quarantine? Like, have you picked up any new hobbies or anything like that? Well, um, during, I'll steal Claire's line, during quarantine. Quarantine, <laughs> yes. Um, I've been fortunate that I'm still working. Yes. Um, but I am doing it remotely. I'm an educator. I work in special education. Mm -hmm. So I log online. And so that takes up most of my morning. Um, what else? We've been doing a lot of home projects. You know, we needed to replace a toilet and a bathroom yeah. floor. And <laughs> right, <laughs> I know. All this stuff has been breaking and, you know, just a lot of projects in the house. I can't find the motivation to, like, clean out cupboards and drawers and stuff. I, I'm always, like, I'll be at work <laughs> and I'm like, oh, you know what I should do? I should clean out this closet or something. And then I come home and I'm like, yeah, that's not happening. I find, I think I'm more productive when I work. Because then yeah. you, you have things to do. <laughs> Well, I think um, you, you have more of like a schedule. And exactly. Yeah. And then now I like, I get home and I'm like, I'm tired from only working <laughs> eight hours today. Like, well, I'm <laughs> home and really I'm home to like, you know, all of summer. Because yeah. Right. Be summer break. And, you know, we pretty much keep fastened up here. My husband is immune compromised. Mm -hmm. So uh, we try to really limit going outside. So I was a ding dong and thought I'd be really great. And buy a thousand piece puzzle. <laughs> you see how it's chewed up at the edge there? Oh, no. <laughs> he could blame this guy. Uh oh, you know what happened? <laughs> trouble. Total trouble. Quinn says, not my boy. No, yes, your boy. I'm going to oh. send him over there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. So, um, trying to do the puzzle is, you know. Yeah, I'll sit right. through and get frustrated after five minutes, and then I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> I love to do puzzles, but then I feel like I get over them at some point. Yeah, you know, there's a lot of area that's the same, so I'm like, Ugh, yeah. how am I going to do this part? So <laughs> I know right? it'll be done by the end of summer. That's my yeah. goal. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so what do you think? Is there anything funny that Ringo or Emma do? Like any kind of quirky thing? Um, quirky things. I don't know. I'm, I'm really impatient when it comes to training. Oh, so yeah. They've trained us. Very I'm just well. like, oh, it's the breed. That's where I come. <laughs> it's the breed. <laughs> um, nothing really quirky or funny. I mean, no, they just bark at every single neighbor that walks by. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they sleep with us like humans. Emma uh -huh. is like master spooner. She is like the best dog to sleep Aww. with. Aww. And so, and Ringo is so funny because my husband's like, they're not, your dogs are going to sleep on your side, not in the middle. And ever since we got Ringo, he gets to sleep with him now. Oh, Penny and Clint? <laughs> the one, the one that he said, don't go get a dog, we're not getting another dog. And then now he sits there, oh, hello, baby princess. Hello, I love you. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. oh hi, Emma. dog. Yeah. <laughs> hi, baby Emma's, Emma. Emma's quirky thing. Crazy eyes. I think we know are her crazy eyes. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> oh, Emma, what's going on? <laughs> <She just did. laughs> there they are. Ringo's, Ringo's jealous. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, okay, this so is their killer thing. Yeah. <laughs> what kind of nicknames do you have for them? Well, other than a whole lot of inappropriate inappropriate oh. ones yeah i mean of course <laughs> uh ringo ringo bingo bingo uh killer a lot because he goes out there like he is just gangster whenever a dog <laughs> walks by yeah i um, like how all the nicknames are like very similar like we call daisy bubba and it's like 
10 variations of Bubba. It's like right. Bubs, Bubba, yeah. Bubba Snooze, Bubba, you know, like all these kind of things. Yeah, we got Emma, Emma Girl. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. This is so unlike her, it's funny. <laughs> <laughs> She's usually so cool and chill when we're all together. So now you get to see her in action. Yeah. <laughs> Someone uh, said, how did they get along at first? Yeah. Great. You know, um, Emma, it's so funny because it's role reversal. When uh, we had Jack, he was such a chill dog. And she came along and she was such a spaz, always bugging him. So now it's role reversal. Now yeah, it's, right? You know, <laughs> Oh, what are you guys doing? They get along beautifully. That's yeah. the answer. <laughs> That's so cute. So what made you want to get dachshunds? Um, we kind of fell into it. So Jack was our first guy. We got him at six. We got him from a family of a family member who was just kind of having a change in life and needed to find a home. So yeah. we got him and just fell in absolute love. Aww. So it's just been doxies since then. And my husband even yesterday was like, do you think we should get another one? And, like, <laughs> and then he goes, no, no, no. <laughs> it was a momentum. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's funny. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah, so just, you know, we just kind of fell into it. I never thought, you know, I've grown up with big dogs. Yeah. You know, never thought we'd get little dogs and yeah, you know, little weenies and so it's funny because our neighbor down at the corner had two hey, hey, hey. and uh frank and beans mm -hmm. <laughs> so you start noticing a lot of them oh that's cool well so. um any last things you want to talk about or anything i don't think so they're favorite food is like giving them treats right now simple food just came out with treats oh cool if anybody's into simple food, <laughs> <laughs> food awesome only 13 ingredients you can read them all oh that's pretty cool no weird things this is only one ingredient yeah uh, this is white fish so no oh. added weirdo stuff so we love simple food they're totally into it and that's probably our main plug yeah. <laughs> oh, no, we just can't wait to see everyone. We're in dire need of a I play know. date. <laughs> I know. I really like if for some reason we can't do this, I I hope we can at least do smaller meetups and maybe do something for Halloween. Maybe it won't be a full on event, but I wanna do something. So yeah, yeah we'll have to check it out. <laughs> All right, well I hope you have a good goodbye. birthday. Okay, thanks, guys. So, thank you for coming on. All right, bye. Bye. All right. Yay, we're still.